Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing my March favorites, and I really hope you guys enjoy. I'm so sorry that I haven't been filming a video this whole month, which is absolutely crazy. Um, but quick little update. Um, I have been sick the whole month, and I have been unable to film my filming video duties. Um, I have had a loss in the family, and just a whole bunch of stuff has gone on and with grades, and I just have school, basically. School, sickness, and family have just taken over my whole life, and I needed to take a break. So this month has just been my break from YouTube, and I'm going to have a two-week vacation as well. So two weeks going on after this video, because I am going on spring break, but I am going to try to upload maybe a few videos just to try to keep you guys fluent. But there is going to be one week where I am not going to have Wi-Fi access at all. But thank you so much for sticking with me if you are still subscribed. So let's just get on to the favorites, which is why you guys came to this video. Okay, so the first thing that I want to talk about is this, and this is the CoverGirl Outlast Stay Fabulous 3-in-1 Liquid Foundation. This is an amazing foundation. It really just gives a flawless finish to your skin that I think is really nice, and I really would recommend this foundation to anybody who is looking for a new foundation. It's high coverage, and you don't need to set it with a powder, which is awesome. Next is a concealer, and this is the Amazing Cosmetics Amazing Concealer, and I've had this for a while. But this is just an amazing concealer. It's so high coverage, and I just have to set it with maybe another concealer over it just to give more, more like, natural, like, more concealery coverage, I guess. It's just a really amazing coverage, and it comes out in a very thick consistency and a little squeezy, too. It's just a really nice concealer. One of the best mascaras ever that I have ever tried is CoverGirl Club Crusher. Oh my gosh, guys, this is amazing. Like, I am not even kidding you. This just gives you guys the most, I'm like looking at my mirror because I wanted to like to show you guys and like describe it as I'm looking at myself. I'm not like self-centered like the thing. Oh, oh, but no. Um, this is just an amazing mascara that is just, that gives just a flawless look to your eyelashes. I, I am not even kidding. My eyelashes have never looked this good. It's amazing. Next, I have been loving the Naked Basics palette. Oh my goodness. This is just the best palette ever. It's all matte with just like one kind of sheen shade, and it's just so awesome. It's so versatile. I am taking it with this with the on spring red because it's so flippin' awesome. So what I like doing is I like taking walk of shame and then just putting this all over my eyelid, like from my from like my lid to my brow bone, just like just to set a nice base, and then taking naked and then putting it in the crease. It just looks so pretty. I just love it, and it's all matte. And then I take crave. Yeah, I take crave, which is a black color from my eyeliner. To apply foundation, I have been loving this little beauty sponge, like beauty blender sponge from, this is Ulta's version. I just feel that it really applies your makeup a little bit more flawlessly than other things, like your hands or a brush. Um, I do sometimes go back and forth with a brush, but sometimes I use this for like a highlighter because I feel that is, it just has a perfect texture for it because it's like more of a stippling thing. So you could stipple on a highlighter, make it look a little bit more natural than just, oh. Speaking of highlighters, I have been loving this Elf, um... Shimmering face facial whip. I can't say facial 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 whip and um, this is just a really nice um, Highlighter I feel that like it gives a really nice dewy glow especially since that foundation is very matte It just feels that it adds a little bit more dimension and a little bit more lifeliness to your skin So I would really recommend this and it's kind of in a pretty peachy color. Um, I think it's in the shade lilac. I Have been loving this blush from NYX. It's in the shade peach and like a lot of these things were mentioned in my haul that I uploaded like Mm, that's what, like the last video I uploaded in March, March 2nd, I think. It's just a really pretty, just like light, kind of like cool, warmish tone. I think it's more of the warmish tone kind of pink color, and I really like it. And it's MAC, so I've been loving matte. Matte is the best thing ever. Okay, guys, these next things are literally amazing. I am obsessed with these. These are the Nivea Lip Butters. Oh my goodness gracious, these are amazing! Oh! No. Um, my favorite is the um, Lip Butter and Macadamia Kiss, and it's just like a clear chapstick, like a clear lip butter, and these just smell so rich, and you get so much product, like, I'm not even kidding, it doesn't even look like it, my voice sounds kind of nasally, ew. These are just really amazing, but if you have nasally voices, that's all cool, I love nasally voices, I love the nanny, it's an awesome show. And then I also really like um, Raspberry Rose Kiss, I need to get the other two, because I've heard those are really good too. And this one just smells kind of like... Sherbert, like, just, like, Sherbert. And the last thing that I have to show you is this Benefit kind of, like, duo that was featured in my haul, along with a lot of the other stuff, like I mentioned. Um, but I have been loving Lemonade, which is a color-correcting primer. But what I thought is really nice is to put it on my dark circles before I apply the foundation, because I feel that it's at the nice base. 
and I don't have to worry about it like it just color corrects the my dark circles kind of making them a little bit more less bluish and purple tone and more of just like a natural flesh tone color but I still have to apply concealer because it does not is not an amazing like full but bam like, wow you don't have any more dark circles but for the concealer boy I really want to get the lighter shade because I got the medium shade because that was what came in the duo and there's no other light shade but I am interested in trying the light shade so yeah, that was my March favorites, and I really hope you guys enjoyed. I'm so, 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 so sorry for the lack of videos. They are going to be coming out more frequently after spring break. So I really hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!